feeling coming into the first weekend? I'm, I'm feeling pretty, pretty excited. I'm a little nervous. Start the rolls, first year of roll. We'll see how we do. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Yeah, it'll be good. Nice and cold. Mm -hmm. Big, big power. What's the temperature out right now? It's more below. It was 15 below when we left Rosal this morning. So Getting warmer. Welcome back to another season of Bunky Racing vlog. Is that what we're going <laughs> Yeah. Um, we're starting the year off, we're going to Pine Lake. So we are en route right now. We've been delayed um, quite a few weeks because of Mother Nature, but we got some cold temperatures. Looking like it's one degree below the donut right now. Um, getting some snow, got some ice built up. So thinking now we're gonna have a quite the year. Um, races are going to start flipping off left and right, so hopefully this is a good one. Where are you going? <laughs> Where are you going? We're going to race Jack. We're going to race Say hey, everybody. Hi, everybody. We're going to back your head right now. We're going to race You got a point. Where are we, Jager? Sportsman's Lodge. Snowmobiles. Yeah, you got to look for the bunky racing one. Snowmobiles. Woohoo. Yeah. Snowmobiles. It's got a lace. Fausties are Fausties here. Fausties are here? That's Ryan and Travis. Ooh. Iceman. Yeah. Iceman. The man, the myth, the legend is here. <laughs> you want to race too? You want to race too? Mm -hmm. Someday. I want to race. You can race, but just not yet. You're still a little too little. Once you get a little bigger, you can race. I'm really glad we're here finally. Yeah. Talking about that on the way in. Tired of testing. Yeah. Whoa, we got it. Hey, stranger. Hey, stranger. Hey, stranger. Hey, stranger. Hey, stranger. We finally made it. Hey there. Got it. Look at that flannel. Look at that water. What? Hey, buddy. Come on. Awesome. Is that Bobo? Yeah. That's the mini mod. How's she feeling, Bo? Feeling pretty good. Feeling fast. Ooh, that's good. Pulling data? Yep. We uh, tried to build a new data system this week and the thing uh, doesn't work. Oh. So that was fun to yeah. deal with this morning. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Hey, I, uh, don't worry about it. <laughs> Excuse us, coming through. What's up, ladies? What's up, Herb? How's it going? Good. Is your wife and baby here? No. Not at all? No, uh, the next one. Okay. Because we're staying at Burgess House and it's oh. like an hour drive. Yeah, and that's a long way for you guys anyways. Up, so. Yeah, it's hard to find. She's coming, but the next one. Yeah. That would be good. I want to meet babe Benny. I know, he's so cute. He's not a baby anymore though. No, he's getting big. Yeah, he's a big boy. Okay, well, we'll leave you to it. Alright. Aren't you cold? Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a little cold. See ya. Oh. You guys, I'm so excited. <laughs> Finally. We're back. Finally, Jagger. Where are we? Say hi, Danielle. Hello, sir. He's. We're trying to get him to take a nap. It's not working. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Bring him over to me if you're trying to take a nap. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. We've kind of given up at this point. Yeah. Well, Bo. Now that you're officially in the pro class and you're racing with the big guys, I think you need a special pro helmet. So Troy Betcher made you a one-off helmet. Oh, and she did one for me last year. We had him rig one up for you. So it's different. It's not 
identical to mine, specifically for number 874. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, that's cool. So instead of the the blue, the navy oh. blue, royal blue background, and the black and the sparkle in there, turned out sweet. Yeah, this is awesome. Yeah, thank you. This is the stripes a little different too. I think it'll match your mm. fancy new wrap too. Yeah, thank you, Troy at Two Extreme Designs for Extreme Designs. This is awesome. Now you gotta drive fast. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, that is cool. The shell hasn't even cured yet. Mm -hmm. Fits good. Yeah, it fits. You're gonna wear it? <laughs> look for me out on the track. I'm trying to look at the side of it. <laughs> they're similar, right? Like they're the same concept, but different. Yeah, you see he's got different colorways. Mm -hmm. That'll match well with the yeah. stock wrap. The sparkle is super mm -hmm. nice behind this. I like it, it's pretty. It is very nice. Oh, I'm feeling pretty good. Getting ready to go back out. Feeling pretty good on the sled. So. Good. What? What? Are we watching snowmobiles? What? I'm watching. The open is off. Everybody cleared it so far. Row three also includes Ryan Faust out of oh, no. Hartford, oh, Wisconsin out of Polaris. Oh, we so I'll be up front. Hey, There's Jager. Jager, Dad's coming. Dad's There's that. Third. Look. Look up fast he is. Go, Daddy, go. Say, go, Dad. Go, Dad. Oh, I hate the snow dust. Can we even tell where anybody's at? <laughs> Good job, Bobo. Hold it, Bo. Ooh. Come on, Bo. Ooh, that mini mod's fast. Hold it, Bo. Come on, Bo. Go get him. Paul and Bo checked out. You caught the group in front of you? Yeah. You look good though. I thought when you're coming through up close here. Yeah, it's tight. Just got in uh, Saturday morning from our qualifier and pro open, feeling pretty good. Uh, sled, doing a couple little clutching changes and suspension changes. Uh, little seemed seemed a little tight this morning, so we're gonna do a few changes and go from there and see how we do. Good job, Emily. What? Emily's checking on these drivers. Come on, Reese with the whole oh. shot. Add it, girl. Nice. Hold, Reese, hold it. Number 132. Oh, that's all right. Adam Brown. She's in the middle. That's good. Now shoot him again. This guy's got a quick breathing. Nice. Add it, girl, Reese. Nice and easy. Unity a little deep on that one. There you go. Nice. Oh, she's making moves over there. It's a little nerve wracking. She's out there with the big girls now. She's the youngest one out there, right? Yeah. She looks like she's found her comfort zone. Oh. <laughs> 
Clarice, uh, how, uh, first pro women's race. How were the nerves? Good. Were they pretty, pretty, pretty intense? At first, yeah, and then it, then it was good. You got the whole shot, didn't you? Yeah, I got the whole shot. Had a girl. How'd that feel? Pretty good. I knew I wasn't going to stick with it, but... They kind of shoved you out of the way there for a little bit? Yeah. Did you have an off, too? A what? Did you go off, too? Yeah, I pulled a corner and rolled backwards. I'm okay. <laughs> did, did, the, got... did the tether pull? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, so how'd you end up? I got third. Uh, you got third place. How'd that feel? Pretty good? Good. Okay. So, it's a combined, uh, it's going to be combined motocross points. So, I guess we'll see how things turn out tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Does this, does this sled need more handling? Yeah. Okay. Get to it, Dad. Yeah. Oh, it's not me. I mean, I do it. But, I mean, my ex, my department's generators and the pizza. coffee and, and uh, pizzazz. Yeah, pizzazz. That's it. Pizza pizzazz. Okay. Right. Good job, Reese. Proud of you. It's a little cold out there today. Oh gosh. You look fast. Wow. Yeah, we had some Stable. mechanical issues. Oh, you did? Yeah, big drift up. So what happened? Uh, the, the seats and the car were flooded in the motor. So oh, no. Uh, you got your sunglasses, too? No. Well, that's not good. Is Reese back in, Levi? Yeah. How'd you oh, feel? Oh! Yeah. At a girl? Are you proud? Yeah, she crashed once she said. Oh. It still picked up. That a girl. She got the whole shot too. Did you see that on the start? I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Are you cold? Huh. What? You wanna go? Okay, we'll go. set up like our Sioux sled so it's it works pretty good it's a different engine package so just gotta hopefully it lasts this is the first this is the first run on is this a sled you're planning on racing in the Sioux not at the moment <laughs> and speaking of first this is Bo's first pro race he's doing one heck of a job out there we've seen Bo go up to the ranks and he's doing a great job at semi-pro last year he was very impressive doing a great job all right there what's his big brother think about that right now with him in front Oh, I don't know. He probably doesn't even know, but uh, Taylor's doing a good job. I think with his with his stalker out there, we're learning for tomorrow. So uh, looking forward to hopefully getting through today, and then hopefully we can start healthy tomorrow. Very good. Ed. I tell you what, the Bunky family has been around racing forever since the '70s, of course. And uh, Gabe, how many times have you won the Sioux? Well, I got we got a uh, eight eight wins there. Yeah. Sounds like an overachiever to me here. So give gave a big hand to the Bunky Racing family. Go up front. Paul Brown, Alex, the team. Yeah, and it's on honestly it's a stock engine. I haven't done any motor mods at all. Is it pretty much like the F3? It's an F3 package. F3, F3 package with a different cal. Okay, that's what I was going to tune in for. Yeah. yeah, we couldn't get, we couldn't, it's too too long of a wide open, you know, duration. 
you know, for where they're at for Cal, for um, F3 or snowcross. So basically, it's just working with working with the, the fuel up at, at wide open throttle above 8250, the way it sounded. You know, maybe cleaning some stuff up down low, but well, like that's said, not my forte. <laughs> the other thing is, too, though, like you said, that's your first week in Outlet, so all you can do is improve from there. Yeah, hopefully. No, yeah, I mean, coming into it, we had no... Right, you don't no know. inclination that that you know that we were going to be able to do what what it did, but the thing the thing of it is is we were just hoping to build something like you said that's that's simpler, easier, yeah. has some attrition. Our leader is 874 Bo Bunky. How about that, ladies and gentlemen? His first pro race of his career, and he showed up here and he meant business. His first career pro race. <laughs> Just finished up Saturday at uh, Pine Lake. Had a tremendous day. Uh, qualifier went pretty good. Um, worked on or ran the mod and really liked it. And then the final came. Um, didn't quite get the whole shot, but made my way through the pack and led most of the race and ended up coming with my first ever pro win. So that was cool. First ever pro race. Super pumped. It was. It was just an all-around fun ride. Uh, loved the sled. Um, huge thanks to everyone at the race department, Ben Hayes, uh, Tom Reger Jr., and, and then uh, Scott for every, everything for, for backing us on this build. Um, it's been a, truly an experience for me. Uh, thanks to Ryan Hayes for coming out and for a day and doing all the cow work. And thanks to my family, my dad, for helping me with the build. and. Um, Taylor for helping us with the build. It's just been a group effort and we pulled the win and we're super pumped, you know, first first time on this new sled. And then of course, got to thank all the sponsors, you know, Climb, Camzo, Walker Evans, Hayes Brakes, um, and then like RCCA, Rosa County Co-op for fuel and all that stuff. It's been, it's been they've been uh, helping us tremendously. So um, thank you and We'll see you tomorrow. The sled is a, the new mod we built, it's a EFI, it's EFI mod, but the motor, it's a stock motor, single pipe, with just a snow cross resonator on it, um, with our Sioux chassis that's been um, lightened, and like we're gonna go to the race at the Sioux I-500. Um, but like I said, stock motor, stock 600R motor with stock, pipe and can and it's truly just a rocket and it I think it turned some heads this weekend and hopefully we can keep it up there on the podium. Brett, any last remarks? Good luck tomorrow guys. <laughs> <laughs> Such a turd that one. Uh -huh. hey, it's what the fuck? Dave ain't got no, or no, is that? Charlie ain't got no goggles on. He must be waiting to put them on. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't forget, but whatever, I guess. Taylor's gonna ride his fucking ass off today. You watch. Got Bo. Got a boy, Bo. Got a boy, Bo. Taylor's out front. Got a boy. I think they're both sitting good. Now your other boys out front game. <laughs> Bo's got a good handle for it. Came into this really nice. Holy sh**, Taylor. That a boy. Yeah, babe. Uh, 
I just got done with the uh, pro qualifier uh, on Sunday here at Pine Lake. Went pretty well. Um, was out front for most of the for the first lap and a half, and then uh, got uh, Herf finally got around me and uh, Brown. Um, it was uh, <clears throat> they were able to out out handle me, so we're gonna make a couple changes and try go out here for the final and try to see if I can't catch them. So. Yeah, we'll, we'll see, feeling pretty good on the sled other than that, so anyway, we'll see you then. You're gonna have to fight through them gloves. Just go out there and you'll have speed, just go out there and be healthy for, is this the final? Yeah. How many laps? Three. Yeah, we don't want you to get cold and lose it that way, so just go out there and set a decent pace and focus, just watch the corners, don't make mistakes. Let up a little bit early if you have to. Make the corner clean. Use your head out there and ride smart. I love you. Come on, Reese. Look at that. They got a good start. Reese got a good start. She's riding smart, though. Nice corner. That a girl. Oh, that one okay. How'd she get third? Yeah. yeah that's good. She held her own out there. Yeah. She got the whole shot. So Reese, you finished your uh, your first pro weekend here. How did you end up? Good. I got third place. I think I got maybe third overall. I don't know for sure. And but was it cold out there? It was cold, but I kept warm with my climb gear. You got glass? Ah! You're so scary. <laughs> oh, you're so, oh my gosh, you're so scary. Ah! <laughs> you are frightening. Go get them. Got her. Watch where that is because the whole shot looks good. Come on. Lines up right beside 101. Last year's winner, Matt Levery. Come on. West Selby out of Grand Lake, Colorado. Go. Nice. Seven shots, one drove at 312 and 173. We'll let it shake through a couple corners. Two is about to start. I can't tell. Oh, Bo's, Bo's behind Evan hey, there. So. In the third okay. position. so it's Paul, Zach, Zach Taylor. Look like. The crowd will give you another update. Then I lost crew, lost track. Taylor's sitting third. I think. Taylor number three. Bo is number two out of his heat. Arlo's got him again. Taylor sticking his nose in there, so hopefully he can get a gauge on where Evan and Bo are setting. There's Bo. Oh, Taylor's in third right now. Taylor's in an absolutely perfect spot right now. Pushing hard. Yeah, it's good to see. Good to see. Got a good, good crop of racers out there. Yeah. There's Beals coming. Are you watching? Look, who's that? Already cat, already cat. There's Daddy. Come on, Daddy, go. Okay, so Paul Brown with oh, Gunnar Arlo is in second, and then Taylor in third, and then let's see, we got Ross Erdman 311. 15 West Selby, 312 Zach Herfindahl, 101 Dan Reverine, 188 Evan Peppel, 17, 874. That four strokes hard, it's fast. This thing's just a war wagon. Well, Bull looks comfortable. Good. One, two, three, four Reverine, five Selby, six Peppel. Seven, who is this? Oh, that's Faust. Seven. Eight. Oh, he's oh, sh coming in. Right here, right here, right here. No, 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 right here. Oh, no. Hold it in there, I don't have the vent open. You need goggles or anything, Bo? Thank you.
Just in case. Walk it out. Got it, got it. Go, go, just go, go, go. <laughs> I didn't expect that. No. I don't think I'm running that fast since high school. Are they neck and neck? Taylor's just out on a mission. I mean he's just just going. I'm guessing I'm guessing Taylor's driving the living Jesus out of that thing just to try to hang in there because he's losing it on the straights. Well I think I just officially froze my boogers. Froze your what? Boogers. I just thawed my note. <laughs> Well, it wouldn't be Pine Lake if it wasn't cold. Right, right. Yeah, it'll come down to a pit stop. Yep. Maybe. Good, it's good. Talking behind him now. Looking good. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Seven. So they'll be starting eight. We got to get Taylor in. He's coming in for fuel. Gunnar Arlo's coming in. Yeah, he knows what he's doing. He can make it. Taylor got out of the fuel stop before Arlo. Arlo's on his four stroke. Oh, here they come. Gunner's closed. Gunner's closed a little bit on him, but good job. Nice. That a boy. That a boy. Along with first time pro rider 7 or something. But uh yeah, we stayed right in the mix. We were close the whole way and and just capitalized when we when we could. Um now we got to tear down and see how see how legal we are. <laughs> huh? I guess. I'll pull the head off for $12,000. Yeah. Roll my first place, $8,000 from, from the Gerald Hill Memorial, $2,000 from Polaris, total of $10,000. A guy that put on one heck of a show yesterday, kind of stole the show for the weekend, but all the exciting racing, if I had to pick one of my favorite, but might have been this race, because his very first pro race, and he came out on top, out of the Bunky Racing Stables, Mr. Bo Bunky. First place for the Gerald Deardall Memorial Factory 600, $10,000 cash, and two plus $2,000 from Polaris, total of $12,000.
goes to Taylor Bunky making this week.